Rabi Matondo has to stay. Welcome back, guys, to the channel. It is the morning after the night before Rangers 2, PSV 2. A new recruits given induction to remember rocking Ibrox. And ah, why couldn't we just defend it, that set piece? I'll tell you why, because we don't defend set pieces. I don't know what it is, right? Honestly, every, every free kick or corner for long throw. Anything, Rangers will concede from it. But... There is a few shining lights. Todd Cantwell, we held his interview after the game, but 20-second clip. Beautiful, what Todd Cantwell said. This guy gets it, we get it, we back him. And, yeah, absolutely unreal for Cantwell in that game. I mean, I think he... I, I don't think he... He didn't deserve to get sent off for the second file that he did, but you, were, you are running that tightrope with him. He loves diving in, and you know what? I love him diving in. I'm not going to complain about it. But let's just talk about Rabi Matondo. You know, we've, we've spent this summer... People want him out. Not everyone. A few people want him out. I've, I've made feds like five players that need to leave Rangers, and I haven't included them. People's like, why are you not including Matondo? Why are you not including Matondo? I was like, because I, I see something in Matondo, right? And let's not get this taken away down, down the road, right? But see with Matondo, it's one goal, right? That's all it is. Pace, pace. We need to keep him for that alone. And I think the guy's got a bucket load of potential. Like, look at the run. Dessers, right? I, I, I've not been the biggest fan of Dessers since he's come in. I think he's been a bit sluggish, but it was easily his best game last night. The first half, I thought he was I mean, pretty horrendous, to be honest. Probably probably was the worst player, apart from the fact that Seema was the worst player, but he scored the goal, so therefore you can't actually get to Seema. But in that second half, Dessers were a great find out. That is what we need, right? That is exactly what we need for Dessers. Balls like that. Put it, if you can't put it in the back of the net as often as other players, we need him to be get setting up goals like that because that was an unreal... The whole goal was beautiful, man. Really should have won the game. Seriously disappointed that it didn't. But Rabi Matondo, that is what we need, right? Counter-attack and pace, and I think he has to... For me, he's got to start against PSV in Eindhoven. He's got to because that pace can set up so much. Now, I think he will be... I think he is technically better off the bench... But I think for the exact game plan that we are going to use against PSV, where we're going to sit back and just defend and then hit them on the counter, I think you need pace. And, you know, Sima and Matondo in the forward areas, like the only guys with pace, I mean, fucking the entire team probably. I mean, R Raskin's actually got really good pace, to be honest. Like, Raskin, when he drives forward past, he's got really good pace, but the in-behind pace that you need to, like, cut defences open, I think Sima and Matondo are the only two that can produce that. But the fact is, Sima in that first half just didn't want to do it. He's just jogging about. Like, they didn't really know where to be at. Um, but then he stepped up and got the goal, and it's a weird one. Like I talked about last night, we actually played really bad in that first half and won it, played quite good in the second half. And lost it. That's just the way football is, though. And that's a two-each draw. You know, it sets up the away tie uh, perfectly. Well, not perfectly. I mean, if, if we won 4-0, it sets it up perfectly. But, you know, we're in it, no matter what. And, 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 you know, it's PSV. Like, I think respect... We've never lost to PSV, right? And in this recent era, the last three games, it's been a win to us and two draws. Like... Oh. PSV fans and PS like the manager of PSV and like De Jong and Joey Fearman, they talk about us like we're fucking pish. The fact is they can't even fucking be us. So respect needs to be put on Rangers' name. Right? Cause if we're being honest, like yesterday I thought I would say we played good. It was our best performance of the season, but there's way more to come for that team. Last year at home, I thought we were shite and we still drew two each. All right, away in Eindhoven, I thought we were good. We, we we managed the game well, but PSV were bad. But realistically, we have not played to our potential across any of these three games that we've played against PSV within the last 12 months. Now, if we played against this PSV team like we had, you know, away to Dortmund, at home to Leipzig, we'd fucking smoke them. Now, they could argue the same thing, right, admittedly, but respect needs to be put on Rangers' name, and that's the bottom line, guys. Five o'clock, career mode, and then later on there'll probably be another in the fed. Who knows, maybe Glenn Camaro will be official by that point. But until next time, peace.